visitation of the college. Our thanks to the Forces Command Band and to the Forces Command Color Guard from Fort McPherson. <laughs> my name is Don Shavey and I'm the Director of the Library. It is my pleasure to welcome you here for this occasion at the Jimmy Carter Library at the Carter Center. I would like to uh, 
introduce uh, a couple of the people who are seated here who will not be speaking. First of all, Mrs. Carter, you're on the end. In the back, we have Secretary Vance and Mrs. Vance and Mrs. Ben Ambassador. I would like at this time to introduce to you the Ambassador to the United States from the Republic of Hungary, the Honorable Ben Ambassador Ben Mr. President, Mrs. Carter, Mr. President, dear friends of Hungary, after a moving and magnificent ceremony this morning at Historic Statuary Hall in the United States Capitol in Washington, D.C., this is an equally and matchingly great and momentous occasion to mark the 20th anniversary of an event that was a major, major building block in the <coughs> long and historic process of Hungarian-American relations and friendship. Okay. President Carter, you are a builder, a builder of trust and confidence and friendship. But of course, we also know that you are a builder in the more literal sense of the word, and you have graced with your presence and your activities in Hungary recently through Habitat. We are also grateful for that. It has taken great hindsight. It, it takes now a great hindsight to see and approve of that, what I'm sure must have been a very difficult decision to return to Hungary at the time, this object that concentrates more than anything else a thousand years of history and uh, tradition. Uh, it divided the Hungarian community. There were legi legitimate issues involved, but all that is now history. And what is fact is that 11 years after the return of the crown, the Berlin, was, the Berlin Wall was down, and the Cold War was over, and we Hungarians are proud of the contributions that we have made. I am very proud that the outstanding Hungarian that will follow me here on this uh, rostrum, who has been the most popular Hungarian politician uh, consistently and in an unbroken pattern ever since his election as president of the Republic after the Cold War nearly eight uh, years ago, uh, is a hero of 1956. Uh, is, it is in the spirit of these thoughts that I thank uh, you very much and all of you for having joined us and making it the emotional, significant, nostalgic, but also greatly forward-looking occasion that it is. Thank you. It is now my pleasure to introduce the President of Hungary, His Excellency, Arvind Mons. President, Mrs. Carter, dear friends, at first I would like to ask you pardon because I don't speak in English because it seems to me that my English is not enough for the occasion. It is my friend in the United States, but I am saying in Hungarian. And may I say, my emotions are not enough. Talán azzal szeretnénk kezdeni, hogy mit jelentünk a magyar koronak. Best of all, I'd like to start by telling you what the Holy Crown means to us Ezzel a koronával koronázta a király az első királyunkat, Szent István. This was the crown. Uh, with this crown, uh, our first king, the uh, first uh, was crowned. 
És azután is csak akkor volt érvényes a királynak a királyság, hogyha ez van a koronával érintetti dolgokat. And even later, throughout our whole history, the kingdom of the king was very tender if this crown touched his heart. Nálunk a király drámák a korona birtokáért folytak, mert a korona birtokában lehetett valaki csak király. Now all the dramas about the kings were uh, went on for the possession of the crown, because he who possessed the crown was the genuine and real king. A korona tehát a magyar történelem folyamatossága. So the crown signifies the continuity of Hungarian history. A magyar államiság az szimbolizálja a Hungarian statehood, és a magyar szuverenitást jelképezi. And also stands for Hungarian sovereignty. Közjogunkban úgy épült bele, hogy a Szent Korona a magyar nemzet teste. And it is built into our laws as the crown is the body of the Hungarian. Hosszú történelmünk során többször került távol az országtól. In the course of our long history, uh, the crown uh, every now and then left uh, the country and was kept away the country quite a long distance. Valamelyik távol étel, a bőrült el a kereszt rajta. And uh, once it was away from Hungary, the cross became tilted. Nem eredeti meg volt a bőrülve. It is not like, it was not like that uh, originally. De az volt, amit a bejelentőt minden felfelelőt a magyar címet. Ever since that happened, uh, we illustrate the crown exactly the, the same way on the Hungarian coat of arms. Istennek hála, a második világháború idén, amikor kézre került. 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 And then the crown was away from Hungary for 33 years. Is minden ki számára Magyarországon jó volt tudni, hogy a korona biztonság. And it was good to know for everybody in Hungary that the crown was in security. Is a Magyarország diktatúra vagy kommunista diktatúra egy kicsit megszállása a tér? Hungary lived under foreign occupation and was. De mikor elmúlt az ideje, hogy a korona visszakerüljön, szinte csodával határos módon az Egyesült Államok elnökében volt látosság visszaadni. But when the time was right for the crown to return to the country, the president of the United States of America had the courage to take that act. És pontosan érezte, hogy az otthon maradt magyarok végül mit éreznek, és hogy és milyen érzelnek, hogy mit éreznek a magyar szemben. And he had a very clear idea and a sense of what the Hungarians in Hungary felt and how they felt for the Hungarian crown. The president felt and the president understood that the crown, after returning back to Hungary, will fortify the Hungarian nation. A magyar nép biztonság tudatát fogja erősíteni. Will strengthen the sense of security of the Hungarian people. És ezzel az érzéssel szélesíti azokat a repedéseket, amik akkor már a dintatban. And with this feeling, those cracks will be further broadened and widened that had already appeared in the dictatorship of the time. A döntés nehéz lehetett, annál is inkább, mert a magyar valamit egyesült államokban élő magyar emigráció megosztotta. It must have been a very difficult decision, because the Hungarians living in the United States were divided in the issue. Egyik részük alkotott a koronasok, amiatt is úgy éreztem, hogy egy diktatúra lesz, hogy ennek a kezét fogják. Part of them were concerned about the fate of the crown because they were worried that it could go uh, into the hands of the local dictatorship. Uh, some thought it was a compromise on the part uh, of the uh, United States. And 
some thought that the crown should go back to the Vatican, to the Holy See, go back to the Pope from where originally, 1,000 years ago, uh, uh, the crown went yeah. to Hungary. Az Egyesült Államok politikai kitűnő formulát tart a koronaviszabásra. A politikai kormányzat a Egyesült Államokban találkozott a koronát, amit az Egyesült Államok előzött. A koronát, amit az Egyesült Államok előzött. A koronát, amit az Egyesült Államok előzött. And that was a turning point. But a major leap that we didn't just take a major result in the whole of Mexico. Because in such a way, the Hungarian people were distinguished from the occupants from the occupants of Hungary. And that was a formula that nobody could change. And that was a formula that nobody could change or had the grounds to refuse. Ezért volt a korona visszavonás a fordulókon. That is why the return of the crown was a major turning point. Ami a későbbi amerikai magyar kapcsolatokat meghatározta. And that was something that became of decisive importance in the future, deciding about the nature of Arab, Hungarian and US relations. A két ország közötti barátságot előkészítette. And it paved the way towards the friendship between the two nations. És ma is hozzájárul ahhoz, hogy két órában közik a szeretetet ér az egymásodát, és tartékét szövetségésére. Merről véletlenség, hogy a korona visszavásának hozzáni kényfordulói érkezik a látottakság. It's a mere coincidence that the 20th anniversary of the return of the crown coincides with the starting of the debate over Hungary's membership in the NATO. It's a coincidence, or it's an incident, if you believe in that. And if you don't really don't think that it was the will of God. If you don't see a symbol, in Hollywood, I tend to see a symbol. Also, the most famous one is the Corona Marshal. You get to see the most famous Corona Marshal. As American people, and now that we offer an authentic, a very beautiful and authentic replica of the crown to the Hungarian, to the American people, is it a good idea to do that? And I have the right to do so. As Erdogan, the last one, the first one. As the first president after the change of regime, just make it clear that you asked him on the total of the votes that he would be sworn. The only thing we have to do is just to repeat the sentence with which the original copy, the original crown, was sent to Hungary. As a result, yeah. This is the sign of gratitude. And also a symbol of the future. És engedjék meg, hogy ez alkalommal tisztelettel adózzam az Egyesült Államok akkoriának különbségét. Akkor itt külügy úgy, a Szárius Vánszó bölcsességét. És Phil Kaiser amerikai nagykövet bölcsességének tökéletesen ismerte a magyar valóságot. To the wisdom of the then U.S. ambassador Philip Kaiser, who was perfectly aware of contemporary Hungarian realities. És köszönetet mondja a Fort Knox. And to thank also to Fort Knox, valamelyik dolgozójára, to all the people who protected the crown like the light of the eye. Mind össze ennyit szerettem volna elmondani. In a nutshell, this is what I would like to tell you. Ez a mai napon, on this memorable day today, amit gondolom néhány nap, minden néhány nap múlva lényeges eredményhez vezet, which will lead to the final result in a couple of days, és formáltad, and will give us megélő és érzelmileg érdekes és érdekes szövetség, formát to the existing alliance that has existed even so far. Once again, I do apologize for not addressing you in English.
I have got too much feel, too many feelings, and too much uh, passion to be able to express that in a uh, adequate way. Thank you, Fanny. So much. There is one more word with which I would like to conclude. Thank you, and God bless. Thank you. Later, when 
hungry had to become completely yeah. free. Right. <clears throat> the other question, why should we return the crown to the people of hunger, not to the government, as an inspiration and a no. symbol of no, liberty no, no. and freedom? <clears throat> My decision was to return to the people of hunger, not to the government. And in the written document of agreement, which I just reread this morning, one of the provisos was that the crowd would always be displayed publicly and would be owned by the people, not secluded by any particular regime. I've never really doubted that it was the right decision. Rosa and I have been to Hungary uh, twice in recent years. Both times we've gone back to see the crowd. One time was in the middle of the day, and the museum was packed with people. We came by and revealed the symbol of religious freedom and political freedom. The other time was early in the morning. We got special permission with the approval of the president to go into the museum before it opened for normal hours. And we took some associates of ours who had been in bots up to Dundee for And we were building, we were building a few homes for Hungarian families. In both occasions, I was overwhelmed with emotion. When we arrived in bots, everywhere I went, the people said, we thank you for giving us back. I'll cry. I'm very glad that we were able to do so. I was attacked by many people. I was even accused of bending the cross on top of it. <laughs> <laughs> that was not my responsibility. Even though I don't know what the battle was returned. But I think that, as President Gustav has said, the crown is, is not only a symbol of inspiration for the Hungarian people. But I hope that in perpetuity it will also be a symbol of friendship and harmony and shared values between the great people of Hungary and the people of our nation. That is my belief and that is my prayer. I want to thank the delegation here for coming. I want to thank the side bands and that's the one who was lucky enough we returned to ground the big serve on the early in 1978, 20 years ago. And to express my deep thanks that this replica of the crown will be a reminder of the people uh, who visit here of a wonderful historical event that has meant so much to me. Thank you very much.